All right, whenever you're ready, yeah, you can go ahead and slap the start ride button. Oh yeah, it didn't play the sound. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's it didn't play the start ride sound. I feel ripped off. Um, yeah, I can I can fix that. Uh, Have you ever had an experience where um, where emergency vehicles come by? And Oh yeah, yeah. At the slightest, at the slightest um, uh, sign of an emergency vehicle, it will uh, immediately pull over, and then unlock the doors and turn on the lights. But I've I've never been pulled over, but that would make a cool video. Uh, <laughs> but I have I have seen like uh, like if it's gonna go into an intersection and there's a fire truck coming, it can hear the sirens, so it won't move. I think I have that in my uh, bonus clips video. Uh, so. So that, that's pretty fun. Yeah, really great uh, detection there, and it, it just detects ambulances with with uh, with the cameras. So it knows that's an ambulance right there, but it, until the ambulance turns on its lights, it won't show the little red ring around it like that it usually does on the screen to say, "Oh, that's an emergency vehicle." because it, it does do that. Um. Uh huh. We're going this way instead. Okay. Uh, probably the most memorable, I would say, is happened in video number 54, where it tried to turn right and then uh, go, and then it got stuck at some cones and then started blocking the road for 20 minutes. Uh, that was not only a cool video, but kind of freaky looking back on it. And then all the uh, media people wanted to talk to me because of that, so I think that made it pretty memorable. <laughs> I'll remember that for a long time. But, uh, yeah, but, um, it was uh, basically a mistake. Nobody was hurt, but it was uh, it was funny. Yeah. At least I think it was. Don't it recognize steamboats? I think those are. Hmm. I think it does, uh, but I think they're also pre-mapped because sometimes it'll go over one really slow and then sometimes it'll just ignore it uh, and, and it's consistent on which one it ignores which makes me think that was part of the mapping uh, thing but yeah I'm not really sure it does go slow over the speed bumps though so. oh yeah I finally dug up the sound <laughs> that's the sound it's supposed to play when it when you push the start ride button but uh, that's also my intro sound. So. Yeah, look at all these fancy companies. Northrop Grumman, and Raytheon over here, I think. Uh, Iridium. Iridium has the, the satellite constellation. GM, Intel, I work over there. <laughs> yeah. Hello. <laughs> More people giving us funny looks. We need something really exciting to happen, but not not dangerous. Just exciting. Is that, There's a fine line in there somewhere. That that'll give me a uh, a, cl a clickbait uh, title. Yeah. <laughs>
what's been one of the craziest reactions you've ever seen somebody? Oh man, one guy. Or do you mean like in the car or outside of it? Either one. Yeah, probably. Um, because everyone I take on the ride is really chill. So I'm thinking the one guy who pulled up next to us at a light, and he rolled, he just rolled down his window, and he's like, "What?" <laughs> Dude, I would never go on that. And I'm like, well, you could. <laughs> it's pretty safe. But, but the, yeah, pe people are entertaining with their reactions. A lot of people like uh, like re recording the car when it when it goes by them, and they don't realize they can try it too. I'm like, guys, <laughs> this is a. Like, wow, look at that, it's so rare. I'm like, guys, you literally live in the first, the, the area with the first commercial robo-taxi service in the entire world. And, like, nobody knows about it. Yeah. It's like a, a well, an open secret. Um, okay, now I'm confused why we're going this way. Oh, it detoured at the last second, and now we're taking the long way instead of the really cool way it had planned. Oh, see that that's the thing about this is you can't choose what route it takes you can only you can only choose the uh, the um, yeah the pickup and the drop off so here here it goes for a slow down for a pump Ooh. yeah that so it had originally planned it, it planned to go down Germain and then hang a left and then go down here which was going to be really cool or no was it Queen Creek yeah I think well, that was but, cool. That was cool yeah. to see that slow down for that dip there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Speed bumps, dips, it does them all, except one of them. I'm not sure why. <laughs> so now that we're going this way, pretty much nothing is, gonna, nothing exciting is going to happen. <laughs> Guess that's a good thing. That's the thing. They're all about safety, and I'm all about. Um, uh, getting used to getting, it. Well, I'm trying to I'm trying to show off the technology. Yeah, and you want to so, you know, document everything. Yeah, everything possible because you've been on so many rides. You've yeah, seen it's like everything. I need I need more edge cases. Yeah, that's what I need. Uh, <laughs> I've uh, if yeah, if I was gunning for views, I'd probably go more crazy on the titles and the thumbnails, and I'd cut down on stuff, but. And yeah, that's my that's my policy. Never cut anything out of the video once the car starts moving, except the audio. Like if we if we say something you guys don't want on the video, then I can take that out. But um, but yeah, when it comes to the video of the car driving, nah, there's there's no highlight reel. There's no no. <laughs> it is exactly as it is. I'm not hiding a thing. Stop. Heck yeah. Oh, in that neighborhood, I had a video. You like this technology, Aiden? Yes. <laughs> what about you, Alana? Oh yeah, <laughs> it just gets so normal after a very a very short amount of time. Yeah, I, every time I'm scared a little bit, I think, oh yeah, there's no way they would let me try this if they hadn't rigorously tested it. I knew it was safe, right? So there was no way they'd let me in here with a camera, right? <laughs> How many but, miles do they have? That's millions of miles. Isn't it? Yeah. A lot, very a lot, millions in on the road, and I think billions in simulation. Yeah. Okay, so my boss is like he is not aware of any overtime. Okay, good. 
It's that yeah, it's always weird when you look in, at buildings and you look at the reflection of the car in the window and you're like, Oh yeah, I'm in those. They, they, I've seen them driving around everywhere. Yeah. Or one of those. You guys smell that? The nice little perfumey scent? Sort of. It's very light, but they, they tell me that's the, um, there it's like, it's more strong when you first step into the car, but I think that's kind of a nice thing that they add for the user experience. I don't know if that's really intentional, um, but they tell me it's, it's scented time disinfectant, so, uh, the more you know. Yeah, I like that one video you had where that it stopped for a bird. <laughs> that was cool. Yeah, I think that was number 55. Probably. But yeah, that I've n I'd never seen that before, so I was like, yeah, my um, if it'll stop for a bird. There's, there's plenty of videos online of Teslas running into cardboard boxes. I kind of want to try a cardboard box in a, in a safe, uh, dead-end, zero-traffic neighborhood or something. Uh, I might do that later today, actually, just to see go around the box. Yeah. And I, I <laughs> like saw that. that, too, in a different one of your videos where, like, a, a paper, you know, a plastic bag was blowing in the street. It, it just, you know, went right through. Oh, yeah. You know, so it's, it's starting to recognize you know, what a normal human would recognize versus, you know, oh my gosh, is that, you know, some animal or object or something I shouldn't be driving into where it kind of knows. Right, exactly. Yeah, like computer that, vision yeah. stuff. Yeah, it is uh, black magic. <laughs> and, well, a lot of work by a lot of cool folks that I want to talk to, but they won't talk to me. They've been very, very silent. Yeah, I think it ends up just taking the same routes over and over enough that I'm probably going to have to drive up farther north for future videos and explore the northern end of the service area bit of extra gas but uh, my videos are finally profitable now so. so it took a while but we got there yeah. shouldn't be too much too big of a deal yeah. so we got two unprotected lefts in a row coming up here so that's spicy if you don't know what I mean by unprotected left I mean um, it's a, a left turn that isn't protected by a left arrow, so it, so it has to use its own logic to turn right or turn left safely. Here we go. This one's a little bit scary for first timers because it'll go into the it'll go halfway over the lane here. See, it's like ah. Uh... <laughs> That's what's cool. Is that it's very it's human. Yeah, exactly. There we go. Stop adding. That that just goes back to my car. <laughs> Arriving shortly at bottom right, fully autonomous. Oh, a little bit late there. Please take all your belongings. <laughs> Occasionally, we replace cars during a stop. 
All right. Thank you, folks. Thank you. Thank you.